that, that particular scotch is an excellent scotch. And if you notice, on the label, you, it shows a, a seagull on a rock, okay? And what happened is a bunch of criminals in Scotland Walk, sailed over to this rock that's off the coast of, of Scotland, and they opened up a brewery, and, and the story's on there, and the very next thing was that they opened a church. That was the second thing that was there. First it was the brewery, then it was the church, and after that, the people came, and that's the story of Oven, and it is one of the best, well, actually, one of the best scotches you'll ever drink. It is a beautiful number. Sin? Oh, uh, believe me. And thank you. The young lady that brought that in, you know I love you, baby. What is your name, please? <laughs> My name is Mills. Hello, Welcome, Mills. Welcome, Mills. Also known as Caroline. Yes. Caroline. And my question is, did they, did they get the excavation permit for the coffee thing last year? Larry? No. The what now? I don't think so. Did they or did they not get an excavation permit for the coffin thing that? Oh, you mean when we buried Larry? No, not at all. Oh, Larry! No, as a matter of fact, we um. We were we, we had we we uh we we. It was at the office, I believe. Leaving human no, remains no, 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 on the well, fire. You mean where the office is right now? Yeah. Geographically, I, I don't know that to be true, but we did do something similar to that, where we diverted everybody and then buried some of his ashes. It uh, never happened. Uh, yeah, it's true. We did. We did. So Officially, it never happened. I'm sorry. No, 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 no. There was no coffin. No, no, no. There was a container with a. Contain you want to hear a really funny story about his? You would call it a relative. If you want to hear a very story, a very funny story about his ashes. When we got them, we were over at the box shop, okay? And so Tristan, Tristan, Tristan comes in. He comes in. Okay, hold on. I got to tell you a story. Come on. <laughs> Tristan comes in, and his family and Dana, we're all around. And he said, hey, watch this. He said, come on over here. And he divvied it up like cocaine. <laughs> Hell. In the, no kidding, in the box. And I looked over, and here they are, and they're dipping up all of his ashes. And were they said, equal? Huh? Were they equal? Yeah, no, they were equal. That, that's right. Literally, they were dipping in equal proportion so that everybody could have some of Larry. And they did it just like a big thing of cocaine. And so that is actually true. And I thought, ooh, at first, but then I thought, oh, that's cool. I mean, it probably wouldn't care anyway. It was the fucking difference. So. Did they do that with Timothy Leary, too? And then he went there. You know, I couldn't tell you if they did. I wasn't there for Timmy's. Uh... Did they put him in that? They sure as hell didn't bury him out here, I know they that. They put Hunter S. Thompson oh, in a rocket yeah. and shot him up. Snorting Larry. They, they did do that. Forward. That's yeah. true. They did. Actually, shoot. my friend at the back shot her dad's ashes up into the sky, too. And it was like 15, 1,500, I think she said it was. Quite cheap. If you Quite haven't cheap. snorted fire dust, you might want to try it. Everybody here has snorted fire dust at one point. No I kidding. I can't imagine it's any worse. So, are there any other qu any questions on any subject? We can answer any question on any subject. Do you have a question for us, Larry? Does anybody eat Larry's eyes? No, not that I know of. Larry but you know, in the privacy of your own home, you can do anything you want. It's an no, you can Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. <laughs> what is your name, please? Uh, Oh, uh, uh, okay. And what is your question, please? Flash, is it true that you only have four license plates? <laughs> <laughs> this is Johnny Carson. And seven Johnny Carson. Wives. Johnny Carson. Uh, uh, but it, it, it is it is true, but I only use two out of the four. I it's, it's well, an excess, you know, it's total excess. And, and that's that, that's for true. It's, I only use two most of the time. Uh, because why are you going to use four? And the one, the one time, the one time that I had somebody helping me out, which was a couple of years ago, and we were putting license plates on, the fucker stole one of my license plates and took off. And so he dropped the trailer up and said, "Oh, I lost the license plate." I said, "That's bullshit, dude. I made him pay fifty bucks for it." And then he quit hauling trailers Ooh, for me because yeah. I know he stole the goddamn license plate. It's like I bolted really? the damn thing on, so don't tell me you really? fucking lost it. I know that I screwed the fucking thing on there, so. Can I ask what happened to the VW thing? Oh, yes. 
yourself? You mean the one that Robert stole from me and I stole from somebody else? Wait, wait, which one? Oh, 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 Josh's shop. Oh, no, I did not steal that from Josh. I, I worked for, I worked, I worked hard to get that from him for a long time. And by the way, Josh, you want to, oh, oh, excuse me, come over here. What is your, what is your name, please? What is your name, please? Uh, tell me, uh, what is your name? Joshua. Oh, I'll be done. Okay, so, Josh, tell, tell everybody, tell everybody how that fucking thing caught on fire. Go ahead, tell everybody how that thing caught on fire. Joshua Hunter. Okay, Mr. Hunter. The year of the anus. Yes, 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 go ahead. And my brother didn't have a car. Yes. So she crashed her car. Yes. And so then he borrowed my car. Yeah. And then he parked it in some grass, and then the grass caught fire. Oh. And then every damn fire guy in Sonoma showed up to put it out the fire. Did he just say in Sonoma? And Sonoma. then I had a burnt thing. A burnt but but thing you, in you guys were welding, wasn't that the case? No, no. Your brother told me that you were welding and you burnt that fucking thing yourself is what your brother told me. I heard that you burnt that thing when you were welding and he couldn't put the fucking thing out. He fucking burnt the thing in the grass and it's got a hot muffler. <laughs> Ew. I got a hot it's muffler. Got a fire. I got a hot muffler. I got a hot muffler too. <laughs> you sure do, Emily. That is true. All right, thank you, thank you, Josh. Let's all give Josh a round of applause. He burned his own car right to the ground, but that's how I got it too. I want you to know, I got that thing as a burnt Volkswagen thing. But that's because I'm a Volkswagen thing freak and I've got six of them. So I mean, I'll take them burnt or otherwise. I was very grateful you took it away with the quiz. Take more junk with you while you no way. I saw that fucking warehouse. I, I held it out for three weeks. I even helped you pack, but I wasn't about to take him with that kid. Was I that? Yes, darling, you were. And so was his dad, George. He was a, anyway, are there any other questions if the, on any subject whatsoever? All right. Come forward. Come forward, young man. Okay. What is your name? My name is Steve. Hi, hello, Steve. Steve. My name is Steve. Steve, hello, Steve. I want to know what's the continuing saga of the 747. Okay. Will it be back next year? No, no, it will not. No, it's a matter of doing that. And, and what it's going to be, I don't know if you saw the performance of the uh, Board of Beer uh, up here today. Because the, the Board of Beer was, uh, uh, was uh, uh, playing out at the Dustfish. Well, Board of Beer has been hired to do their show for one year in Las Vegas, Nevada, okay? And and they're gonna do an art park in front of the a beautiful tent that they bought several years ago in France, in France. And it's a beautiful tent, and they've got a great show called Soil Dust, which when I saw it even five years ago, I said, man, that's Las Vegas. Well, as it turns out, and now, and if you haven't seen it in the past year, it's worth seeing, it's called Soil Dust, and it's gonna be in Las Vegas for one year, starting in March. And it is a wonderful show, and if you go to any show in Las Vegas, no kidding, this is better than anything from Circus du Soleil, because they've gotten to Mamby Pamby pretty, pretty, you know, it's everything. Where is the Soil Dump is a fantastic show with original music and really a uh, very, very broady. Okay, very, very, um, well, well. Like what, Hamilton, they are not sponsoring this show, by the way. Who, who is it? Not there. Oh, then I go. Oh, yeah, yeah, sorry. No, you're right, Emily. You're right. Emily's right. Vodafone is not sponsoring the show. I'm saying this totally on my own. And so, well, of course, my daughter. But my daughter is in the show. But that's what they're doing. It's a great fucking show. And you should see it. But oh! So what we do is we we do a show at Kelly's Lane. Come here, young man. Seven forty-seven will be in Las Vegas. What is your name? Give him the microphone. Oh, oh, what, oh, is, what is your name? Oh. Oh. My friends call me Biggie. 
Big E. 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 Big With no details. No details. <laughs> Burn it to every goddamn thing. I want you to know some of the flaming Lotus girls were out there. Amanda. Flaming Mr. Lotus. Mr. Carter. Yeah, there was, the yeah, everybody, there was people that came down to help us do it. And it was an amazing piece. And if you haven't seen it yet, it's out on the playa. Like almost straight out from here. And then and tell the, a story. Tell a story. Oh, yeah. and, and was, we did it with the Girl Scouts. As a matter of fact, <laughs> okay, what happened was, there was there was a, a, a new subdivision going in. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, drink break. Whiskey break. You're gonna love this story. That's Whiskey. a damn fine. There was a uh, classics, folks. Okay, there was a new alcohol. there was a new subdivision going in Las Vegas, in North Las Vegas. And and when they went to dig up to start the, the building of it, they hit uh, uh, dinosaur bones, and in particular, they hit mastodon bones. And, and the surrounding That's area of Tule Springs is surrounded by some well-heeled people, to put it mildly, okay? <laughs> uh, uh, actually, if you've been down in Las Vegas, uh, the, uh, the Thomas and Mack Center, one of them is Dawn Mack. There also, there was um, Wynn's wife, who's now the ex-wife of the Wynn, and they were all living around that area, and they were determined to not let them build that. So they took it all the way to the Washington, and by the way, one of the Congress women, women from uh, Nevada was there with them. They took it, and at one point in Washington, uh, in court, one of the developers looked at those ladies and they said, don't you ladies have something else to do with your time? <laughs> Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, it's now the new National Park, <laughs> motherfucker, and they ate that son of a bitch alive. So here's this for the women. And, and by the way, one of them was the CEO of the Girl Scouts, which, by the way, if you don't know, the Girl Scouts have financially taken over the Boy Scouts because those boys don't know how to run shit. Yeah. <laughs> and they don't have There you go, girls. Be proud. There's a few boys in the Girl Scouts now. No, no, but they, no, they've actually taken over financial. The Girl Scouts really? own the Boy Scouts. That's so, right. Yeah. That's not the way I heard yeah, it, Joey. I heard, it, I heard that yeah. the Boy Scouts yeah. now yeah. must admit yeah. girls, which yeah. made the Girl Scouts angry. Yeah. Uh, has that been resolved? No, no, no. <laughs> what, what it is is they took them over financially, so they have no say in the matter whatsoever. Ah, uh, they have to shut up and follow the money. That's right. The follow the cookies. <laughs> yeah, follow like the cookies. The anyway, are there any other questions here? Hey, Biggie, good seeing you, buddy. How are you? Brought up a new one. Hey, Biggie, have you seen it though? Did you go out and see it? Yeah, I saw it. What do you think? I, what's the funny story is we used to go out there when I was 14 on our motorcycles and do burnouts on those phones. Oh. It's been around for a long time. I know, I know, and you know what? We picked up all the crap and we put it on that fucking thing out there. All the bullets, everything that we could find out there, we built that pretty much with the jump. And if you look at, if you look at, while you're out there looking at the mirror, you can see it. There's one part that's a, a 240Z. Did you see it? I, I, used, I cut up half that car and put it on that mammoth. They were all busted up out there. I did, yeah. You'll see it. You can see it. There's a 240Z and all the hood and half the fenders are on that mammoth. And Bed Springs. There's Bed Springs. So if you haven't seen it, go out and take a look at the mammoths and you'll see that it's nothing but a bunch of junk. But it sure looks pretty when you put it all together. And thanks to many people, especially... The Girl Scouts and the Flamin' Lotus Girls, they were with me on the whole thing. So they were And yay, it's Dana Albert. And this happens to be the home of the Flamin' Lotus Girls right here. Right so here. We're
I'm the Robin Hood in the hood, and who are you? Okay, and what, and, and what, I'm your god. What is your man. question, darling? I want to know what happened to, to the, the, the fence. The fence? Where's the fence? The you mean the fence? I gave you the fence. I brought it over. Where? Where is that fence? You mean the one with the tube thing? Yeah, where? Where is that tube? I brought it over to you. No, 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 no. You tried to bring it over, and the flashmobile broke down. Oh, is that what happened? the grammar. 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 The The that's right, and well, the and, but you know what? What's your fence when you have a 1964 stretch Cadillac with the bullhorn on the front? Who needs a fence? You're already so fucking cool just for riding. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Robin Hood in the hood. 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 Robin Hood